currently on spring break and I'm also an introvert so I was like why not film my spring break as an extra or introvert sorry not an extrovert we are like halfway through spring break and um you guys did not miss anything exciting in fact this video might not be that exciting but i'm starting it today because i do have senior photos being taken today not professional ones because i don't care that much for senior photos um or my school um my friend her dad is a photographer but she is the one who's going to be taking my photos so she has like a camera probably i don't i don't know bought a romper a green romper i'll show you guys later but i bought a green romper it, i thought it was a dress um but when i tried it on apparently it was a romper and i thought it's cute i thought i liked it i liked it so i bought it and it was like 50 dollars. i know that's like a lot but yeah it's a lot I'm making scrambled eggs and bacon, if that makes any sense. I don't know if I mentioned this yet, but I'm kind of like filming this spring break vlog a little bit late because we're already like halfway through, which is kind of insane to think about because um, I feel like I haven't gotten any rest at all. Anyways, um, all I've done is like go to work. Um, I wanted to start it today because I do have like senior photos to be taken today. The photos are actually due on by the end of this month, by the end of March, and it is like March 15th today, I think. So it's getting pretty close. So this is the the romper. It, it looks like a dress because I thought it was a dress, but it's a romper. Um, but it's really cute and I really like it. Um, I don't know if I'm going to do anything with my hair. So right now we're going to go shower and we're also going to pick out another outfit for because i'm gonna have two outfits i'm gonna have that like more of like a springish but if it's not the vibe because there is snow on the ground outside okay uh, so i'm just gonna take another outfit where it's just like casual fit kind of thing so we're gonna go shower scratch the working out because i can't i don't have time to work out right now um i have some news uh, this this side looks fine this side looks fine this side has a little identity crisis going on like super poofy because i i brushed it out but this side looks fine this side i keep trying to like fix it but i'm pretty sure i'm just making it worse yeah it's looking pretty bad Yeah, this is the casual outfit look. First pictures that we're gonna take is in this. So we're gonna put this on right now. My friend's sister has a camera and they're gonna be using that. Um, so this is, I have my crusty, musty, dusty um, Nike shoes. <laughs> Great. Um, I did my hair like that. Um, it's all right. I have my turtle necklace. I have Taylor's rings that they just don't match. Oh my god, my nails are so bad. Okay, we're on our way. Um, yeah, everything's going really bad. I put more nail polish and it just got worse. Um, I have nail polish on my hands. I have not nail polish on my romper. Um, my shoes are really dirty. <laughs> um, I think my hair looks really bad. I think everything is just bad. The only good thing that was going for me was this dress thingy, and and that's ruined now. Yay! Okay, we're here. This is great. I think I think we should take I think we should take one right here. What's your plan? Because there's snow all over the fucking. Okay, so there's a lake there, snow, trees. And a swing, so we're gonna we're gonna do the swing. It's cold.
there? There. Okay, good. Okay. Um. Woo! back from the, the thing and honestly i think it went pretty well it was really cold it's like 40 50 degrees outside which is like good but it's really windy and there's still snow on the ground so it's not like warm you know what i mean i thought it would be like warm but it's not unfortunately but i think we got some good pictures i think honestly i think there's only like three good pictures there is one picture on this swing thingy that I think I showed you guys. I think it turned out really nice. Um, I might use that for like graduation invites. I am going to eat some watermelon right now. And I have some other stuff that I have to do that my mom wanted me to do. Like wash dishes, clean up. But also she wants me to take jeans and like clothing that I don't want to wear anymore mainly bottoms just the like jeans and like leggings and stuff and um sort that out so we'll do that so a while ago i made a video on how to crochet a bouquet of flowers right and one of my friends she lives out of town she moved last year anyways she saw my video and she was like how much for a bouquet of flowers and i was like i don't know i had to go through the whole process of like thinking of how much to um sell them for and how many she should get and blah 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 and blah 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 anyways i told her that they'd be done in two to four weeks and it's been like six yeah it's just been a busy um month anyways um i got a whole bunch of flowers over here you can't really see right here got a whole stack of them mainly daisies because i think that's what she mainly wanted um in my video i had originally used puzzle glue to glue everything together yeah don't do that why because it's really difficult so this time i have a whole bunch of glue sticks because it was for my independent art project and i bought a hot glue gun from my workplace and I was like, oh, okay. I didn't know that we even had hot glue guns. So this is, this is great. What is this? Oh, is this a stand? Um, I'm also doing this on the couch, which is flammable. So I'm sure it'll be fine though. So I have a whole bunch of these like already like cut up and stuff. I'll show you. I have a whole bunch of them already cut up, so all I have to do is like twist them and put uh, some green yarn around it for the stem. But this is gonna happen. These are pretty long, but I think I have to like bend them like this so that um, I think it's just better like this. I think, I don't know. Okay, we have to take one of these, stick it in. Honestly, I think for this one, we don't even need any hot glue because it's like staying up pretty well by itself and you, that way you can like also move it a little bit. Not really, but here's the flower, the flower. Um, okay, only took like 30 years, but I, I've got a little flower. Um, I do think it's a little bit, what do you think of the length? I think this is a good size like if you're gonna put it in a vase this is like a vase is like this big you know i don't want to make it like super short like this and then like it not being able to fit in a vase you know what i mean um i have like a bunch of flowers to do oh i'm gonna show you how i'm going to do the lavender ones so for the lavender i probably shouldn't have cut these so big but for the lavender I'm gonna put hot glue on the top or on the flower 
the flower, the very beginning of the flower. And then we're just gonna wrap it around. I think I'm gonna wrap it around the four, though. So then it's gonna be like that, but pretend it has, I already wrapped green yarn around it. And then all I have to do is put some hot glue on the last petal and, or on, on the stem and just glue it like that. And then you've got a lavender flower. I'm just gonna cut it the same size as this. So, so like in, almost like in half. And then I also made two carnations or whatever the heck. I still need to make like the stem part of it, but they cute or whatever, they cute or whatever. We are at Hobby Lobby right now to get yarn. We are on a yarn mission. Hallelujah. Okay, I want to make like a... So I know Valentine's Day has already passed. But I really want to make like a, a Valentine-y kind of cardigan. So I want to make like... um. I want to get like pink and red. I like these two colors. Look, I like this material though. Okay, so I'm gonna get this because like, I have another project that I want to do with like flowers that I saw on Instagram. So I want to try to do that with just one color, and then if it goes well, then I'll do it with some more colors. We got our yarn. We're gonna go look at some drawing things now. Yeah. Things caught my eye in like terms of photography, like. I feel like this could be really cool for like some really nice like photography shots like mainly like in a forest and nature because i'm whimsical and stuff i guess but i really like this a lot okay today we are at the store right now we're at nike store so maybe we could get like a fun workout outfit because i'm trying to get back into working out so maybe a workout outfit will motivate me Okay, these are all the shoes that I like. I like these. I like the color green. These are for super duper short people. See, so like short and then super short. I like how it has like green inside. These ones are funny looking. I tried these on. They were interesting. I like these ones. They're like beige. We're at the mall now and we're looking at art. Oh, that one's really good. I really like the middle one. I like that one. Love. Is that a picture or is that a paint? They made it out of cardboard. Ah, that's cool. That's cool. That one's nice. I don't think that's a paint. But that one's really pretty. That one's really good. That one's So I'm not on spring break anymore, but I thought I would give a little bit of an I thought I would give a little bit of an update. Um ignore that. Anyways, at the store I only found like one thing. We went to multiple stores. I usually get discouraged to buy anything because of body image issues. So I usually don't like buy anything, even though I'll see something and I'll be like, oh that's cute, I want it. And then I'm like but do I actually want it? Like, will I actually wear it? Where will I wear it? What will I wear it with? Because I have zero fashion sense. 
the only thing that I did get was like this workout top that I so conveniently have lost. It was literally out there. Now it's not. I can't. Where did it go? I found it. It is this color. I it's like a I thought it was blue, I'm gonna be honest, but apparently it's like a green. I'm gonna wear it. I'm very excited because this is like my first like workout workout thing, my bubber. I don't know. This is what it looks like on the back. It's like it has a lovely cool whatever. I don't know. Anyways, we're gonna work out today because we're actually working out. We're like turning a new straw. I don't know what happened, and we're just like we're like a whole new person. Like you know when you're like in the middle of the night you get a burst of energy to like change your entire life that's been me for the past three days so i'm doing great so far i'm doing great my spring break hasn't i didn't really do anything all i did was like stay inside crochet tried to work out but didn't um i tried to edit but didn't um what else went shopping but didn't what else? I did spend a lot of time with my sister though, which is good. And I did clean the house a lot more often than I normally did, which is really good for me because um, back in COVID, I used to clean the house a lot because that was like my main job. So um, doing like whenever I clean, it's like like a therapeutic process for me now. Anyways, um, I am doing a cardigan. So this is like, I'm going to make a video on this. Have I really filmed it? No, um, but we will. We will eventually. Um, Anyways, thank you so much for watching, and um, next video, maybe coming next week, big heavy on the maybe because I don't have videos, so yeah.